Hey, 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 hey. Love Dr. Nikki from Arenum.com here, and I hope you're having a bright, blessed, and beautiful day. It's a gorgeous day, and 2023 is almost here. Uh-huh. Are you ready for it? Uh, a lot of us aren't. Now, this video is specifically geared towards those of you with a annual cycle year of five. And for those of you who missed how to compute it, it's really easy. You take your birth month plus your birthday plus add seven to it because 2023 is a number seven year. Now, of course, you break it down into 14 becomes one plus four to be a number five year for me. So make sure you get that comp computed right. And if you need help with it, you're always welcome to stop by uranium.com. We can always check it out for you. Absolutely. Now, in this video, we're going to be digging down and finding out what you can expect as a number five. Now, there's plenty of dynamic changes coming for you. It might be a little bit bumpy because you're going to have to make some decisions on the fly and you're going to have to really be careful about what choices you make. You may see plans come to fruition that were laid a long time, maybe even as much as two, three years ago, finally coming to fruition. Opportunities will be coming your way in both the financial and romantic sector. So keep the eye out, especially if you're looking for a long-term mate. A number seven year is a year that is focused on spirituality, connection with your higher power and that kind of thing. So you take all your good luck for being a number five and add that to a number seven and you're sure to have a banner year. I'm Love Dr. Nikki here at Aranum.com and I hope you'll stop by live stream and say hi. Bye-bye.